this side. So, okay, okay. Um, I'm going to beat him a bit. Yeah. Okay, so you're looking at the internal rotations. If you've got good internal rotation, it's a good sign. So from there, okay, so now we need about 30 to 35 degrees. Okay. Okay, so here's again, you know, we've got movement, so it's not as bad as maybe was anticipated, but he's a little stiff at the end. Okay, and then you, what do you feel there? Do you feel a little tightness in there? Yeah, just a little slight pull in there, yeah. Yeah. Okay, but surprisingly, that's not bad. If you've got a, a real problem, problematic hip, you, you lose this movement there. So that's not bad, but he's definitely stiff, stiff that way. So we do a part of a treatment to try to encourage this movement here. And it might be stretching the tissues, stretching the capsule. Um, you'll improve him, but I don't know how much you would improve him. You can also get him to pull his knee towards his chest and pull, 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 pull. How's that feel? In your groin? A little bit tight there now, yeah. Okay, and then you can test the other side. So if you're restricted in that way, and restricted in that way, and restricted in that way, then you've got a capsular tightness. Yeah, if you're restricted in most of your planes. And why is the capsule tight? Maybe because the hip is a little bit unhappy. Being the joint is just a bit irritated. Okay, so you might have a little. Oh, oh. 46. Okay, so you know, if you've been a runner, um, and I've been running a lot uh, in the last 20, 30 years or so, then you know, things are going to change a little bit. It doesn't mean you stop doing stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it might be like there's a, there's a little change. Mm -hmm. But it will be. You know, anybody over a certain age will have a little change. Uh, but um, that's where it is, okay? Okay, and then we can test. So we know there's, and then I do the same on that one. So we'll watch again, so you cross the leg over. We can see the, the, you can see, look, see, it doesn't like it. Yeah, so because what you do when you compound in the movement, the movement specified to the rotation, okay, that's okay, and that's a little stiff, but when you add in a component of the flexion with the rotation, it doesn't like it when you bring it out. Yeah, so it's like a compound movement for the hip joint. So there's some, so for me to treat you, I'd be looking at this hip joint, yeah, if I'm treating this calf, calf. And then we'd look at the back and all the rest of it.